Hey guys, it's me again. Uh, it's time for video number two. I was asked a question and had way too much to type for the response, so I figured I'd make a quick video and also um, talk a little bit more about about me um, and why I even have any knowledge to share with you guys. Uh, first off, the question is from Lexi. Hi, I live in South Jersey and I have no plan of moving to LA anytime soon considering I'm 15 years old. I have headshots, but not professional. I will get them, though, at a later time. And I live close to Philly, which is becoming a new popular spot for film. I don't know where to start. I went to an open call at Mike Lemon Company, a popular casting director in Philly, and I got put in their database for speaking roles. And now I'm starting to take classes. But other than that, what do I do? Lexi. Uh, Lexi, you're doing everything right. You're doing a really good job. As I said before in my uh, the text response, the only thing I would try to do is leverage the fact that you're young, try to get in on doing uh, work as an extra on movies and films, and try to use the fact that you're young to get SAG vouchers. That way when it's time to move out here, uh, you know, you'll already have your SAG card. As far as the IM, IMTA, International Modeling and Talent Association, uh, I think that's a really good deal. It's just that it's it's not cheap. It's a couple thousand bucks because you're paying for the agents and managers to fly out. You're paying for their food, and you're paying for their hotels. So it's it's a legit setup. It's not one of those scams. A lot of things that you pay thousands of dollars for are scams. This is not uh, because I've met the agents and the managers. Uh, they were uh, agents and managers of my friend, but I've met them on different occasions, and uh, they fly out to you know look for new talent and. That's a legit thing you can check out. It's great because once you get here, if you already have an agent and a manager or you know one of them, you can kind of hit the ground running. You can already start auditioning. A lot of people are just trying to live when, once they get out here, so it takes them a while to get an agent or a manager because you have to get headshots and you have to figure out who you're going to send it to and all this stuff takes time. It takes a you know it takes up a lot of the actor's time. Most people end up packing their bags before they even. <laughs> get an agent or you know they leave around the first year uh, also for people who are Lexi's age or whoever any actors I would recommend going to school I know that doesn't click I know that doesn't make sense to you up here because you're like oh why would I go to school when I can I wanna be an actor I wanna act I get it okay I get it but like I said before most people can't even survive out here most people leave after about a year if you go to school out here you're not gonna leave you're going to do a lot more acting than you would if you moved out here because you can take acting classes, like acting classes at the college. I know that sounds counterintuitive, but you're, it's it makes so much sense. You know, um, It's easier to blow off a class and go to an audition than it is to blow off your job, which is paying your rent. So go to college. Check out junior college. It's an awesome alternative. Let your I'm sure some of you might even be fighting with your parents, like saying, uh, I want to be an actor. I don't want to go to college. You know what? Say I want to go to college. Strike a deal with them. You know, Make some sort of deal. Say, but I want to go to college in California. And you're also going to make better connections that way. You're going to meet more people that are uh, that are not actors, that maybe you know people in the industry. Uh, you know, maybe film students. Maybe you can get together with film students and shoot some short films. All that stuff. Great idea. I highly recommend checking it out. Wow. Right now I'm so tired, but uh, maybe I'll tell you a little bit about me right now. Uh, I've been out here for five years. Uh, I've had two agents in that amount of time. I've gone on um, quite a few auditions, some really fantastic, like life-changing type auditions, which obviously I didn't get the part. Uh, but I'm not trying to explain. I don't know if I said it at the beginning of the video. This is not a video of like, oh, I can teach you to be famous, because obviously I'm not famous. Like I get that. But I can tell you stuff you don't know. Uh, so I can give you like that first uh, jump start on everything I didn't know that I wish I knew before I came out here, and that's kind of what this this video is about. Uh, I've I worked at one of the best headshot labs in town, so I've seen all of the best photographers. Like I know what a good headshot looks like. I worked there for over a year, so I've seen a lot of headshot photography. I know exactly who's good and who's not, who's overpriced and who's not. Uh, I'm going to USC School of Theater this semester which is like top three or five, three, I don't know, top three or five in the nation for theater schools. So that's kind of my background. That's, uh, you know, that's also kind of where I'm going, my direction. Uh, a little bit about me, what I know. 
once again, guys, ask questions, comment, let me know what your questions are, and I will do the best I can to answer them. I'm also going to start, when I start putting out more and more episodes, it's going to be more topical. I'm going to have like, I'm going to say, I'm going to talk about very specific things. But right now, I kind of, I'm kind of digging the Q&A thing. Ask me questions. All right. Have a good night. I'm going to sleep.